Alan Steve from TechnoWorks. I'm going to talk to you about custom zoning on your NX or Reliance system. There's a really cool feature in the uh, in these panels that allows you to build a custom zone um, outside the normal instant or delayed zones or a standard 24 hour zone. You can build a zone to do something special. So if you fitted a card like the ConNav, um, you can take advantage of the fact that it can send you messages. So say for argument's sake you wanted to put a, uh, a read switch on your front gate and you wanted to get a notification every time someone came through the gate, like you know someone's dropping a parcel off or something. So imagine being able to wire a read switch into the alarm system and all its purpose in life is to do is just to send you a message. That's all that, that zone does. The NX Reliance programming allows you to actually build a zone to do that. So I'll show you what I mean. So I've got a panel here with a ConNav installed. I've got a read switch here, so this could be on my front gate for argument's sake. So it's wired into a spare zone, it's into zone 8, which is not being used on this panel. So basically, someone would come through the gate. I've got the keypad also chimes to give me a message. But also, on my phone now, I have a notification to say that someone's come through the front gate. Um, it's a really cool feature, really easy to set up. Um, I'll take you through the basic programming of how you do it. Um, so let's look at the programming side of it. Okay, we're ready to do our custom programming. The first 20 zone types on an NX or Reliance system are totally programmable. You can change the way they operate. So that's how we can actually make a custom zone. So what we're going to do is we're going to pick, um, we're going to use uh, zone type 19, which is not a very used type zone that's used very often. So we're going to modify that for our purpose for the gate alarm. So what we're going to do, basically we're going to go into program mode. Program code in, go to device zero. And what we're going to do first is we're going to actually go to um, and create our um, new zone type. So if we go to location 104, and what we need to do is we need to turn a couple of segments on. We're only really interested in the first three segments. So we're going to turn on two, which is makes it a 24 hour zone. In this next one here, we only really want four and five on. So we want the two and the six off. So we get rid of the two and the six, put on the four, four, and five makes it chime and also makes it um, bypassable so if we have a problem you can actually turn that zone off so it's just a handy feature to have um, in the next segment turn everything off we don't need anything on at all five, six, seven, eight. and the next couple of segments we don't need to worry about as well so we just come out of that and basically we're um, um, I'm programming this is on an NX16 panel at the moment so we've changed our, the Type 19 now behaves as a 24 hour charmable and bypassable zone. It doesn't do anything else, doesn't set sirens, doesn't do anything else. So what we're gonna do now is we're gonna, we've got our red switch wired into zone eight, which is a spare zone. So we go into um, feature 18 and we need to go to segment eight. Okay, we're in segment eight. By default, it's type 16, an instant alarm. We're gonna change that now to a 19. All right, that's our programming done now. We can actually jump out of programming. Okay, so once we exit out of programming mode, we can actually test our read switch to see if it works. So we would close the gate. The gate's now closed. Um, basically what we do is we open the gate. We expect to get a chime on our, on our um, keypad to tell us that the gate's been opened. And also there's a notification popped up on our phone to say the gate's been opened. Really, really simple. Um, and like I said, it's quite a simple programming thing. It is a very powerful feature in the NX Reliance system to be able to use those custom zone types. Pretty much you can build a zone to do anything you want. You know, say for instance, you do something similar to make it so when someone presses your doorbell um, that you got a notification the doorbell had been pressed. Um, have fun with it. Hopefully this has been a helpful video. Thanks for watching.